Today, I'd like to show you how to create bookmarks within Fourscore, and what better piece than to use Handles Messiah, since so many of you are performing this, and there's so many different movements and sections in a great piece like this, and the score has over 260 pages in it. And so sometimes you just really want to be able to find exactly what you're looking for with the touch of a button, and so bookmarks are the answer. So let's say you're a tenor working on this recitative, and you just want to be able to jump right to it each and every time, and even put it in a set list. So you're gonna tap in the middle, Again, bring up your navigation bar and you're going to go over to this second icon that looks like a book. So make your bookmarks. So you can see I have a few already, but you can notice I'm missing one for this second movement. And so to create one, it's pretty easy. You're just going to go up and hit this plus button. So first you'll need a title, so I'm gonna click here and then I'm just gonna name it number two since it's the second movement. You don't have to include a number, but I'm going to. So I'll call it Comfort Ye. Uh, and so once you're done with that, you can click in this bottom right to get rid of the keyboard. So whatever page of the score you have pulled up will automatically be the starting number of your bookmark. And often you'll need more than one page, so you could either type that in here if you tap that, or you could come down to this arrow and keep hitting to the right until you find the end of the score. And I can kind of see it here, it's a little small, but there's the end of the score. And so if I just hit save, I've instantly created my bookmark. So once you've created your bookmark, you'll know it's the bookmark because it'll, it'll say in parentheses here. So you can tap on this gray bar and then you can treat it like any other score and you can add it to your playlist. So let me add it to my Messiah playlist here just to show you. I'll exit out. So then I'll go up to this third icon, the set list one, and I'll scroll down to my Messiah playlist, tap on that, go all the way to the bottom and it's added that new bookmark we created. Uh, so this is a really awesome way to have all of the specific movements that you would like in a set list in order. So you can imagine this might take a long time if you have multiple bookmarks, even dozens uh, that you might want to do in Messiah like this. It could take a long time if you did it with the plus button. So if, if you'd like to learn how to make multiple bookmarks all at once using this index button here, then check out my next video where I dive in how to do that with indexes. The last thing I'd like to show you within bookmarks here is if you do this plus button, you'll notice at the top you could choose item, which is how you created the bookmark we just did, or a page. If for some reason you just want to jump to a page and you don't care about adding it to a set list, you could do so this way. And this is the same kind of thing. It'll just jump to that page.